Gary, Sin <laughs> Gary Sinise was in town. He's got a band called the Lieutenant Dan Band. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. 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 Of course he and, does. <laughs> and actually, I laughed as well as you guys did, and I Googled it, and he goes around and tours to wounded vet, oh, um, wow. wounded vet things. Yeah. So don't you guys all feel like jerks now? <laughs> and, uh, let's get all that out at the beginning. Oh, yeah. You know, Let's just transparent. This is how much it's going to cost you. If you go over yeah. a little bit, it's probably not going to be a big deal. So now let's talk about the music. Yeah. Now let's talk about why we're all here, you know, and, and doing what it is that we do. Yeah. So I, here, would you would you sync it up to Synthy? Would you like have a striped track on the analog tape? And yeah. Yeah, the, uh, we used a 24 track, uh, an Atari MX70, and uh, Studio Vision. Um, and, you know, Studio Vision would drive, like, whatever producer or whoever made the beat would bring in, like, a SP12 or, um, what was the other one? Oh. Uh, Sonics. Yeah. 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 Right. ASR10s, 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 yeah, exactly. That's wow. the, you know, you can, this is so different than CDs or MP3s or, you know, just the physical thing. Mm -hmm. He's got a turntable in his room now and a tape deck and a tube power amp and he made a total snob. <laughs> <laughs> One more target! Yeah. No. <laughs>